We're always trying to find good deals on Pokemon cards. That's why I bought some off of Wish.com, AliExpress, and Temu. Probably not a good idea. First item up is supposed to be an Evolving Skies booster box. Yes, a 36 count box of Evolving Skies real packs. This is what it came in. And this is myself trying to actually open it up. It actually, all oh, these items took so long to come. And I'm very, very eager to see, as this is just extremely beautiful. Wait, is that, that's not even Evolving Skies. Wait, so you're telling me you're telling me this is supposed to be Evolving Skies? The packs are not even upside round, they're upside down on the inside. I mean, frankly, most likely with a price like that, we knew this thing was gonna be fake. But at the same time, there's always dreams. What gave it away? Massive energy in wild color. Discover new brilliance and maximum power in vivid voltage. Well, I mean, it's missing all of the little Pokeball stickers, or excuse me, the imprints all over it, so that's a dead giveaway. The uh, clearly uh, different color design of the box itself. We, we're gonna have to actually take a look at some of these. Wow, and all of them, oh, look at that. Looks exactly like real packs. And then there's the first pack of what's supposed to be an actual, hopefully right here we put what a real Vivid Voltage pack is supposed to look like. I'm actually curious, before I do, the, the tops also give it away. I mean, if the color in the box itself didn't give it away. Oh, sometimes these come with like, tons of EX cards on the inside. <gasps> yes, we got an amazing rare. Is that what those are called? I completely forgot. Uh, but any case, uh, these, I mean, they're flimsy. They can tear very easily. They don't have the little black on the inside, but there's a, uh, I've done videos before. We got, we gotta get, actually, I like how this one's turned around. That's like the rare to make it like even more, Toucan Sam, uh, make it even more crazier. If you want to do a little look, you know, I'm gonna hide the rare for myself so it doesn't give it away. It's a garbage. Garbador, at least the only like hollow part is this part and not the entire card. So still no EXs. I just really, really curious before we move on to the next card, if there actually is an EX. These are fairly difficult to open up. <gasps> oh, so I will give them that. I will give them that as we did get a full art. There's no texture on it. Is that the cards look like they're actually from Vivid Voltage. They got the set symbol too at the bottom. Well, that was nice. Moving on. This is supposed to be a mystery box. This is some sort of other language or numbers on it. I'm not exactly sure, but you can see the listing. I wasn't really sure what this is actually supposed to be. Oh, that actually looks real. There's no way. Is this, I mean, that's a real Japanese back, but it, there's just something off of it. I mean, I'll take these out. Are these, oh, they're sleeved. Wait, these actually look real. No, they're fake, they're fake, they're fake. Wait, are these real? No, no, you're not fooling me. That's fake. Oh yeah, that's fake. I don't know why. There's texture on the card. I also don't think there's such thing as a Pokemon Center Mega Tokyo with uh, the Pikachu dressed up in the Mega Charizard. I'm just surprised. I mean, it's yeah, it's blurry on the back. I'm actually a little bit surprised with this thing. Hold on. I mean, they're not real, but this is, are they getting smarter? Look at that. There's So there's texture on it. It's a Pokemon card from the 20th anniversary, so real Pokemon card. Hey, it's a Squirtle from, uh, is it 151? Wow, that's crazy. Wait, there's texture. There's no, there's not supposed to be texture on this card in real. Look at that. You can see the spiral of it. There's not supposed to be texture on it. No way! We got the, we got the Eevee! We got the Eevee. Is that even a real card? The screaming Pikachu card. I don't think there's a screaming Eevee card. Still really interesting. We got the Misty. I'm not sure if that's Misty's determination or not. Uh, so there's the, you know, the Rayquaza cosplay Pikachu. Different type of texture on that. Evolving skies, or evolving, not skies. Alt art, at least we got it's cute. Very, very cool looking. I will give it that. The texture does add a lot to these. From far away glance, it does look real. The back does not. I promise you, it's just, 
It's blurry. <laughs> and then this is totally not real. Kiln forming flames. Flip one energy attached to the defending Pokemon. It's now a fire energy. Wow. Flareon V, glass stained. Vaporeon V Max. Charizard! We got a Charizard! Get out! Get out! Okay. It's a Charizard, and there's a first edition stamp at the bottom left. I mean, this is a cool texture. The texture is only on the holofoil picture part, and then the borders of the card. I will give it. That's semi impressive. Ace Rolla, full art trainer. Glass Kyogre V. Kind of cool. Pikachu, Mario Pikachu. I never was the biggest fan of this type of box, but I'll give it that. And it's cool with the texture on it. Hey, and then we got a full art trainer. All right. Uh, I was marginally impressed with that one. Moving on. I am not sure what these next two items are supposed to be, whether it's one order or the other. I'm not sure. None of them came with the freaking deck box, which was the reason I wanted to order these. None of them. That order or the other order. It's just, these are clearly fake cards that I can't even get out of this. I wanted the deck boxes. Those, no matter if they're fake or real, just have a cool design on it. These are just a bunch of energies. It's a bunch of energies. Whoa, that's cooler on that side. Weakness guard energy, capture energy, shish kebab, shrimp on a stick, lightning energy, energy recycle, do your part, double colorless energy. I, I regret ordering this. <laughs> energy blend energy, secret rare darkness energy. I think that's from like, uh, 2016, maybe Generations. Oh, there we go, Secret, yes, yes. That's kind of cool with the Umbreon in the background. And then Lucky Energy. Didn't even come with the Dex box. Well, we're gonna get luckier. These actually look fairly cool. Yeah, baby! These are the most slipperiest cards I've ever seen. <laughs> How am I supposed to? They're at the grand entrance, because these actually look cool. These actually look cool. I just, I need to get these on here. Okay, these actually look cool. I just can't hold these. They're flimsy, have a little texture on it. But look at that, a Drapion, Drapion V-Star. What is this one? A Curum V-Max, even like the texture on the card of like the outline of the Pokemon in the text, I will say is pretty cool. I just cannot hold it, it's not even a real card. The Ox is VMAX. I mean, obviously it's not real cards. Uh, Urshifu VMAX. It's the birds from Hidden Fates. I'll take that one. Mimikyu and Ace Rolla. Oh, that one actually looks really cool. The Charizard and Leon one. We got Snorlax. So I think some Battle Styles ones. But these actually, look at that Charizard. These actually look fairly cool. Mew, I just wish they were on thicker cart. I mean, I don't really wish anything, but because they're not real, but if they were, if they were, if they were on cooler cardstock, I don't know why I'm just going like this, that's cool. Like thicker cardstock, I think these would be really cool. Giga Impact Co. Is that a different language? Clutch, no. Send a Scorch, Jolteon VMAX from the Jolteon box. Yeah, these, I mean, I wanted the deck box. I want the deck box, moving on. The next item is supposed to be 40 pieces, but I'm not really sure if it's packs or individual cards, because again, it looks like who knows what's going on on the actual image listing. So I bought some, guess it was supposed to be randomized packs. Yeah, I guess everything is just vivid voltage. I thought they were real for a second in the package when I took them out, but they're clearly not real but I will show you the difference between two fake packs. Yeah, they're both fake. They both have that same ridge, so I guess that's a commonality. That one's something's going on with Pikachu here. It's all sparkly. Let's take a look and see what our hits are in these four packs. It's crazy how many fake cards are on these sites. Uh, there's a Pikachu V, which looks awfully good, but the back is definitely a different scale. We got two EX, two ultra rares in one pack. That is incredible. Pick a peck, look at that reverse foil. Pikachu, another Zarude if you're a Zarude fan. And well, quickly, so again, I uh, this is from AliExpress. There's just countless, countless amounts of these listings. I highly suggest, now you know, if you didn't already, don't order on 
AliExpress. But now we're moving on to Wish.com. I only found two listings on Wish.com that really called my name. One of them was a big lot of what's supposed to be energy cards, but the other is supposed to come with one vintage card that is real. Yes, I stake my claim on not being real. So opening it up, cards actually look real, but I mean, if they're energy cards, I don't think that's anything to really brag about it being real. It's kind of just like, oh, okay. Oh, ooh. why are these sleeved? We'll reveal these in a sec. Let's take a look. Oh, these, oh my gosh. We got old, wait, th yep, these are real. These are real. So this is Wish.com's finest. Lots and lots. I'm going through these because I want you to see if there's anything good. I want to see if there's just magically a Charizard sitting on the inside of these, but I, I guess there's not. So that's not the energy lot, but we got a trainer card, holographic card. There it is! It indeed did come with, ooh, the condition on it's not that nice though. But then again, a base set two Pikachu card, worth maybe a few cents. And then there's this pile. I, I just, I don't know what this is. Uh, I, I'm assuming I just ordered it and it just took forever to get here. Wait, why is this? There's something sleeved in this one too. Whoa, whoa. These are all trainer cards. That's a base set trainer card, a rare one. Devolution Spray, a Neo Genesis Focus Band, Gym Heroes Team Rocket card, and then actual real, real cards from Fossil base set. I mean, they're not really worth much, but still. Jim Challenge, Giovanni's Machop, Doduo, Parasect, Egg, Staryu, Nidoran, Caterpie, Poliwag, Poliwhirl. And then, revealing door number two, it is a Haunter. A non-holographic, imagine if that was hollow, a non-holographic Haunter. Wish.com, at least they were real. But moving on to Temu. I got a lot of items from Temu, starting with one what's supposed to be a grab bag random Pokemon plush. I, again, just wanna say, I don't know how Temu is making so much money that they're able to afford six Super Bowl commercials. Just wanna say that. But we're moving on to the first item. Plushie is Sprigatito. And it looks like it actually did. It is an actual not like off brand one. There is a, a Pokemon logo on it. Let's actually take it out to make sure I've had bad luck in the past with substances being on the plushies that I've gotten from some boxes before. So, so far, Sprigatito is okay. Moving on to the next item. Again, grab bag special. It's supposed to be a Snorlax sleeping mask. It's supposed to be a Snorlax sleeping mask. Well, probably shouldn't have put this on my face. But there we go, a Snorlax sleeping mask. Yeah, there wasn't many more Pokemon card options on this thing, on Temu, believe it or not. Next up we have stickers. Stickers, but there's also, whoops, there they go. Stickers and these. I believe these are supposed to be for Crocs. Now, I don't own any Crocs. Yes, you're welcome. It looks like these would actually connect. Oh, there's a Squirtle. I mean, these are, these are pretty cute. But these are supposed to connect to the shoes. There's a Charizard. I don't know if that's like a, a, a baby Charizard from like Yu-Gi-Oh or something. We got a little, a chubby different type of uh, Pikachu, an Eevee, another one, Bulbasaur on something. There's a Psyduck that has like a tan or something. Uh, there's a Togepi that's cute. And then a little Gengar. So those are kind of cute. I wish I had some other type of place to put those. Moving on to the stickers that this comes with. Uh, got, so more of this design, which are really cool. You have an absolutely random design of Laddies and Latios, which is like real, like, these are all like kitty, and then you have, <laughs> doesn't even have eyes. Uh, there's a Mimikyu. Mimikyu's a bit different. Got the apple, cute Pikachu. Oh, I do love, I love the more realistic looking ones. Sticker of the stickers, King. I mean, don't get me wrong, these are cute. So, stickers, nice, that was nice. Moving on to the next item. Ooh, this is supposed to be, this is supposed to be a nightlight. Odds are if it actually turns on by when I actually am able to open it up from this bag. It, does, is it supposed to be a little Pikachu nightlight? Oh, the tail actually moves. I can see like some blue on, the, on its butt. All right, so let's go like that. And one, two, 
three. Whoa! Look at that! Okay, this is the coolest item out of all of it right now. There, he can be up there sleeping. Let's see if that actually lasts the rest of this video. Moving on, this! It looks like it is more stickers, but a roll of different stickers. There's the Squirtle sticker right there. Oh man, there goes the Pikachu one. But well, thankfully there's another Pikachu one. Roll of stickers. That is actually everything. Let me know what you thought, if this is actually uh, good cards or not. But in the meantime, click on the video right above me right now and please consider subscribing. Stay awesome, stay positive, and I will see y'all in the next video.